Yes, it may be just a tragic accident. The death of a West End woman killed as she tried to cross busy Central Parkway. Adding to the tragedy is the fact that one of the drivers of the two striking vehicles is a Hamilton County Appeals Court judge. Nine on your side reporter Tom McKee is live with new information on the investigation. Tom? Carol, it was nearly 24 hours ago that Pamela Barnett was hit as she tried to cross Central Parkway here between Lynn and Ravine Streets. She made it to the yellow line in the middle of the road, but then was first hit by the car driven by Judge Patrick Dinkelocker, and then a second driven by Grace Ring. Flashing police lights lit up the night Tuesday as investigators tried to determine exactly what happened as Pamela Barrett, a mother, grandmother, and great-grandmother, crossed Central Parkway. Jack Ellenberger saw Barnett in the middle of the road and in the rearview mirror what happened next. I actually saw the one man strike her. I had no idea that he had actually hit her. I thought that maybe he had swerved. Um, to miss her. That didn't happen, and Judge Patrick Dinkelocker got out of his car, emotional, distraught, and trying to keep his composure. He couldn't hold the tears back any longer, and had a little bit of a cry there. I mean, I, I wouldn't blame him. This accident truly is, in the purest sense, an accident. It's very tragic. First of all, for the, the woman who was killed and for the drivers involved. Lieutenant Bruce Hoffbauer is commander of the Cincinnati Police Traffic Section. There's no signs of impairment. There's no indications anyone was speeding, and we have a person in the roadway. Barnett lived in this building on Central Avenue in the West End. Donald Young grew up with her and can't believe she's gone. She was a very nice person, very nice person, and, and her daughter and her two, two granddaughters were very, very nice. And we're going to miss her. Barnett's brother and daughter visited the scene of the accident Wednesday, still in shock about their loss. She was a devoted mother, devoted grandmother, devoted great grandmother, and the family's having a hard time dealing with this tragedy because it was so sudden. Well, I haven't been able to reach Judge Dinkelocker for comment. Grace Ring did tell me by phone she was sorry, but she did not want to talk about what happened here. Coming up new at 6, Barnett's daughter has some emotional words and a very special request. Tom McKean, 9 on your side, live in the West End.